What is up, YouTube? It is tea time here. We're back with another video, and today we're going to be talking about Moon Knight. Um, episode 3 just came out. I am liking the series more and more. I was afraid that I wasn't going to like this series, or just this episode at least, and it'll make me go down for the series. But it really picked stuff up. It really got somewhere, and I enjoyed it. Um, I'm going to probably give this episode like a nine, nine and a half. Uh, but yeah, let's, um, if you guys are new here and you guys have not subscribed, please subscribe. As well as you guys enjoyed this video, you know, leave it a like. And, uh, yeah, let's get in our, into our review of Moon Knight. So, we got this scene with all this, right? But, I mean, obviously we have some stuff to go. So we'll just be looking at this while I talk about it. Um, Layla, we start out the episode with Layla. And she's with her mom. And they start talking. And if you guys didn't know the comics, there's her dad. The comic character that she's based off, her dad was killed with those people at the archaeologist or whatever it was, right? So those people that Mark killed last episode that we saw could be her dad. And um, we'll get back to that later on. But Arthur is searching for the scarab, right? Or he's searching with the scarab for the Amit's tomb. And I think he ended up arriving at that point. But we see him later on not there, so I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, Mark ended up fighting some random guys, you know. We cut to him, and he's on a roof. He's trying to... I mean, obviously, they're not random. They just killed somebody, right? But he starts fighting them. And something happened. Like, Steven took over, you know. But then after that, he got knocked out. And Mark woke back up after everyone was dead. And him and Steven are like, it wasn't me. It wasn't me. So I'm guessing Jake? Jake Lockley? I'm not sure. Maybe. Um, but yeah. Him and Conchu ended up talking. They said, we need to talk with the gods. They make um, an eclipse happen, pretty much, you know. And that put up a portal or a door. And Mark went, in, Mark went into it, you know. It was for the gods. It was a pyramid. They ended up talking to Conchu, all these gods. I'm pretty sure Bast was there, the Black Panther goddess. Um... Some other gods, I don't necessarily remember their names. But, yeah. Hartho, uh, Ar Arthur Harrow ended up showing up, right? And he talked, everything like that. Nothing ended up happening. And Mark is, like, looking around, stuff like that. And Layla shows up. He's looking around for... I forgot what it was called. He's looking around for something. Layla shows up. Now they're a team. They team up. Um, Steven and Mark are trying to work together, you know, trying to figure stuff out. But Steven is a little like, nah, I don't want to. But then Mark is like, all right, all right, just go kill all these people. And then he's like, all right, all right, all right. But then, obviously, they're at this um, place that they went to, right? And Harold shows up again. And they're talking to him. And he ended up trying to bring up what Mark did to Layla's dad in the comics. So I'm guessing that's what he also did here. But, yeah, um, Moon Knight ended up showing up, and he kills everybody, right? And Layla's about to die, but she shows some, she shows some pretty cool fighting moves. She's about to die, but Moon Knight comes in. We see that he's bulletproof. It's cool. But he gets really violent, you know? And because of that, Mr. Knight came in. And then he gets stabbed, like, immediately. But, like, this is the part where he's jumping off, you know, saving him. But, look, this is what I mean. He gets stabbed so much. And then, yeah, Mr. Mr. Knight comes in. He gets stabbed a lot. Moon Knight takes back over. And he gets that stabbed, like, ten times, right? And he sees Layla's about to get killed. After she kills this other guy, 
amazing stuff with their necklace. Um, he ended up taking all that out, killing everyone around him, and then coming after her to save her, and then killing the other guy, you know? Um, yeah, we end up going, driving a little bit, and we see the puzzle. Mark's like, all right, bet. Steven, you come in, take over, finish this. And he does it. Conchu and Steven ended up changing the sky, you know? This is this scene right here. And I just wanted this, this is bad quality, but just the visuals on this was so amazing. It was like a movie. I'm telling you, it was like a movie. But, um, yeah, they start changing the sky to go back 2,000 years ago. And now they know where Ahmed's tomb is. But Khonshu is imprisoned. I'm guessing either Mark dies for the time being or he just loses his power, you know? Um, yeah, we'll obviously see that next week. Let me know how you guys feel. Did you guys like this episode? I really liked it. I love the violence in it. This scene right here made the episode for me. The beginning was a little eh, but it gave us some good detail on the gods and stuff, you know? Um, they did end up mentioning Madripoor. Um, but that, yeah, this scene ended up making me intrigued. And then this just had some amazing visuals on it. This whole episode was amazing visuals. Um, yeah, let me know how you guys feel. You guys enjoyed this. And uh, I'll see you guys next week for the episode four review.